should be starting. Uh, let's see here. Stream should be starting. Please give me one. that. Hello! Uh, I'm just getting things started, so uh, make yourself comfortable, I guess. About YouTube and social media and everything. Uh, so let's see if I can Find the uh, chat. Why are we here at midnight? Why the hell would you not have a, a stream at midnight? Howdy. Yeah, YouTube is a uh, is a uh, shit. <laughs> Can channels be demonetized for chat comments too? No, if YouTube doesn't like your chat comments, your super chat comments, what they'll do is uh, take the money and donate it to charity of their choosing. Uh, Sylvana Lucas, I, I am dead inside. <laughs> Uh, yeah, it's, it's a stream at at night. I, I'm sorry that it's late. I might do this again tomorrow, but I, I just... I don't know. Today was low-key for me, and I don't know if I can hold on until morning about this. Uh, let's see. Uh, thank you, Drake. Dragsaw. Things are going personally well for me, but I, I have worried prospects of the future. Uh, so let me go to... How many people do we have with us right now? Wow, 191. Wow, that, that's a lot of people already. Discord controversies I'm not familiar with. Yes, the next technocracy is going to be on Twitter. The episode is already written, and I'm having people go over the scripts right now. Uh, but in the meantime, my editors are currently working on animation reviews, because, you know, I have to do those. Uh, yes, I heard that Reggie is leaving Nintendo. Yeah, so, um, if you haven't, um... If you're not in the loop, just recently, YouTube announced that they're basically going to start demonetizing uh, channels because of the comments that people leave in the videos, which is completely rife for abuse, and we can get into that. Uh, YouTube, YouTube ending monetization. They're not doing that yet. It, 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 it seems like it. But, uh, yeah. Uh, you, you can't disable comments. That's the funny thing. If you disable comments, your videos will stop... You're, you won't get the interaction you need for your videos to be searchable. They won't get in the search rankings. A, a lot of people, um... Had that problem when uh, YouTube first moved to Google+. A lot of people, including the biggest people on the site, they just turned off comments, but it did disaster. It had disastrous effects on their channels because of the algorithms. Oh, that, that's pretty cool. Um, so, yeah, we're... 
Yeah, Google Plus is ending soon. Yeah, that, that's the one issue that I, the one factual error that I made in the uh, YouTube episode. I said that Google Plus was already shut down, but no, af after two data leaks, they decided to keep it around for a little bit. Uh, hello, real gamer player. Thoughts on the new Aladdin trailer. <laughs> I, I've, I give a lot of my thoughts on this stuff on Twitter. Uh, Will Smith seems to be trying to destroy his career. He's going to become like a reverse meme. He's going to be in the, the every place you just don't want him to be. Uh, so, yeah. Right now we're working on the Twitter episode, which has been the most difficult episode to write. Uh... because uh, there's going to be a lot of controversial stuff to talk about in that episode. Uh, also, if you're wondering right now, you're listening to the L.A. Noir uh, menu music because why not? It, it's coming and I don't want to get copyright flagged. I don't think I will get copyright flagged for this. Does Wattpad have the... I don't think any other website except maybe Google has the, the issues that, uh, that, uh, Facebook has. Like, I, I hope you guys, like, I, I do really kind of want to confess my reasons for doing this technocracy documentary series. It, it's really important to me because... Over the past few years, I've just gotten more and more frightened. Not not just disillusioned, but actively frightened by the big social media conglomerates. Like, right now, we're, like, the um, episode I'm writing now, or trying to, is about Tumblr. A lot of people are expecting me to write about the leftist SJW craziness, but no. This, the, the series is about the websites, not really the people on the websites. And when I talk about Tumblr, I'm going to mostly be talking about how basically, in just one move, they basically crippled their platform, and they crippled a lot of people who had legitimate careers. I, I have streamed before. It, it's, um, it is definitely a bit of a rarity. Uh, although, like, I feel like I might have to do this more often because of Super Chats. They, they really, really mean a lot to me. Yes, yes, Tumblr is dead. It, it's mostly going to be like a post-mortem type episode. Oh yeah, the censorship, uh, that, that's going to be Twitter's primary deal. Twitter, the Twitter episode is primarily going to be about... Uh, social media censorship, uh, and freedom of speech online. Yeah. yeah, each of these, each of these websites does give me something to be afraid of. Like, Facebook, I, I don't use it, but the way that it's shaped our understanding of our privacy online, like, that's, that is bad, even if you don't use it. Oh yeah, Twitter accounts get blocked all the time because of mass reportings. YouTube has demonetized channels for all kinds of reasons, like recently they demonetized a piano channel for quote-unquote repetitive content which doesn't make any sense uh, are you considering streamlabs yes uh drake drag saw i have heard about gab.com and when i talk about twitter i am going to talk about that and the parallel internet i i, I don't know anything about uh, uh, Wattpad. Will you do a technocracy video on streaming sites? Um, not really. I debated doing one on Amazon, 
but uh, it's not really a social media platform. Uh, thoughts on YouTube banning conspiracy videos. They shouldn't do that. They, they really, really shouldn't do that. Because, like, conspiracy theory is... It, it's a dirty word, but there is the off chance that one of these conspiracy theories is going to be, you know, legitimately real. Or someone is going to write off criticism saying that it's just a conspiracy theory. No, parallel internet... It, what I mean by parallel internet, instead of Google, you use DuckDuckGo. Instead of Twitter, you use Gab. Instead of YouTube, you use Mines. Parallel internets are are basically websites meant for people who have been banned on one website, for instance. Uh, I don't think there's anything wrong with Mines yet. I haven't used it. I haven't really looked into it. No, uh... This, this is different than Orwell's nightmarish future. Yeah, I, I heard about the killstream getting banned by YouTube. I, my thoughts on Alex Jones getting banned from Facebook. I, I don't really think that was, like, necessary. I mean, the people he's making conspiracy theories about and actually, you know, going after, he's getting sued by. Like, he's suffering the consequences that he deserves. Oh yeah, Don Hertzfeld is pretty good. I, I really want to do a review on his works, but it's it's complicated. What, what is going to be the most uh, difficult episode of Technocracy? Twitter, so far, is the most difficult. Like, Google might give it a run for its money because there's just so much wrong with it. Any issues regarding Wikipedia? Yes. Uh, like, I'm thinking of actually extending another episode to source websites, like Wikipedia. Because all you have to do to manipulate Wikipedia is basically write an article and, or a blog post or something like that, and then have Wikipedia link to that, and then it, it's cited. You can create a legitimate Wikipedia page by citing nonsense. If I also talk about Wikipedia, I would also throw in Snopes there, because Snopes has issues too. I haven't watched Shane Dawson's conspiracy theory videos. Ah, oh, the, the chats are going so fast. Thoughts about the upcoming second ap apocalypse? Oh yeah, th that's gonna be fun. Uh, so, yeah, some guy apparently, uh, found a problem that YouTube was already taking care of as best as it could, and then started basically tackling, uh, advertisers to try and get them to pull out of YouTube again. And, uh, the guy has been revealed to be pretty much a creep. Like legitimately a creep, like asking someone who looks underage to star in uh, an adult film. Uh, yes, the topics of the eight episode, the main things of the so far eight episodes of Technocracy have already been decided. And uh, yeah, when, when somebody uh, talked to uh, Matt uh, about people who would legitimately lose their livelihoods because of the internet, or because of... Uh, a second apocalypse. he says, get a real job, and coincidentally, this is going to be what the Tumblr episode is about. The real jobs. Y you know, there are entertainers, there are actors, there are comedians, there are artists, there are reporters, every, every other thing you consider a real job. They're all on the internet, but because they're on the internet, it's not a real job no more. Ugh. I have no idea what TRO is. Uh, yeah, a lot of people are really propping up uh, Vanillo, and that that's good. They, they've gotten some steps ahead of uh, previous things like uh, Zipcast or Vidme. The problem that I've noticed with the website, though, is that almost every video on the platform has no views. For them to really take off, somebody has to make a risk. 
Vanilla is the latest YouTube competitor. No, he meant like a real job, like what you're doing on the internet isn't... isn't... thing. Uh, isn't... something that's difficult, something that... is worth getting paid over. Oh, the right opinion. Yeah, I, I like him. Uh, yes, I have a Discord server, but it is private for business purposes. Why does YouTube have a problem with CP? Okay, like... I'm not going to blame YouTube for having a problem with everything, for every little thing that's on their platform, because at some point, these websites, they get so big that no matter how many people, no matter how many bots, no matter what you have, you will never catch it all. Ever. It is... Like, there's always going to be shit getting through the cracks. All the time. Like, when I brought up uh, Pollution Entertainment in the uh, YouTube episode, it's not just because some random uh, monster uploaded a video of himself murdering a cat. It's the fact that YouTube, when approached by it, didn't take it down. Uh, I do not think I'm going to be doing an episode on Amazon. Will you watch the new Norm of the North... Oh, this is a thing I missed. Will you watch the new Norm of the North movie? I already have, and it's the next animated atrocity. It's already in editing. Yeah, CP is an acronym for a lot of things. But yeah, I, I do expect the next big apocalypse. So one thing that might change is I might end up uh, streaming a lot more often. The only issue is that my channel isn't really conducive to streaming. Like, I can't stream a cartoon. I can't stream myself making a review. And my gaming channel is somewhere else, and it doesn't really get super chats. Let's see. Is Fox... No, actually, Fox has really calmed down with their copyright stuff. Uh, thank you, Antiheartless45. I am I am trying my best to not give up and not give in, but it gets it gets harder with every single change. Like technocracy here is basically my my biggest attempt to fight back, some sort of attempt to take control of my own fate. Uh, to say that if something does happen and everything breaks down, at least I. I at least I put up a fight. At least I said and did something. And it seems like I am opening a, a lot of people's eyes to a lot of the shit that goes on. Like, one thing that I... One episode that I really think is going to open a lot of people's eyes is the Apple episode, because Apple's episode is basically about the concept of ownership of digital property. Like... You don't own any of your iTunes library, you don't own any of your Steam games. And pretty much everything you buy online, it, it's not yours. Uh, thank you, Dark Fierce. Uh, that means a lot to me. Uh, AO Refrigerator, I already uh, did review Gertie the Dinosaur in my Windsor Re McKay uh, retrospective. Will we start seeing you talk about anime? Ah... Uh, one of the Patreon rewards is, uh, uh, an anime. Will you do any more anti-SJW videos? I'm not anti... Uh, I'm not anti-SJW. I, I, I stick to my own opinions, not specifically anti-anything. Newgrounds, I think, is pretty cool. I don't use it, though. And no, I'm not doing an episode on 4chan. I don't really think there's much to talk about. Like I said, it's about... It's about the websites, not the users. 
Are you going to talk about the pedo problem on Twitter? Uh, yeah, I'm going to talk about it in context of pretty much everything else. What music do you listen to? I listen to everything. Uh, so much of everything. Uh, but yeah. This YouTube change, like, I keep thinking this is gonna be the one, you know? This is gonna be it. This is the one that causes massive, massive backlash. But, you know, it never does. It, it never, ever does, and I'm getting convinced that it never, ever will. I mean, when their YouTube Rewind became the most disliked video on the website, what's the response? We're debating removing the dislike button. Uh, I don't think I've had his spoilers given to me for YouTube, uh, YouTube thumbnails. Yep, I heard YouTube now demonetizing videos with bad comments, and that's what we're talking about. Uh. What is the worst website, in my opinion? Out of all of them? That, that's, that's a tough one. I guess it depends what context we're talking about. Like, Tumblr itself is just stupid. It, it's not evil. Uh, Facebook is just a business conglomerate. Google, Google is really, really worrying me. Google, Apple, Twitter, and YouTube. I think those are, those are the big ones. Yeah, Twitter, Twitter is just... Like, we are going to be talking a lot about, uh, freedom of speech on the internet, and I know a lot of people are very annoyed by that conversation, but it needs to be talked about. Ah, uh, the music stopped for some reason. Why did the music stop? Uh, opinions on the Machinima Purge. If you're on YouTube, do not join a multi-user network. I, I don't know why people still do in this day and age. One day, just Machinima just disappears. Are you considering doing another video like The Genius of the Beginner's Guide? I want to do stuff. Like, I want to make videos that I want to make, but because of algorithms, I can't. Like, even if people are interested in them, chances are YouTube's just not going to show them. No, I'm not part of a network. I've never been a part of the network. Multi-user networks are, are basically... <laughs> They sound like multi-level marketing, and they're kind of up there. Uh, the multi-channel networks, they did have power when they were initially uh, formed. Uh, they were what you needed to get monetized at all. Uh, did I miss your super chats? Uh, I don't know. What do you think could have prevented all of this social media company's nonsense? If our government understood the internet. Uh, sorry Ryan, I'm not answering growing around uh, questions in this chat. Yeah, I, I'm, I'm seeing. Will you do a technocracy on streaming sites? Let's see. Uh, so a person's YouTube channel can get completely demonetized because some people type... Uh, they can apparently demonetize individual videos. Uh, do you think that YouTube will block your video as if it's promoting another video sharing site? Uh, they could. I mean, Facebook rises up videos that keep people on their own website, and there are some accusations that linking to other websites uh, pushes your video down on YouTube. But yeah, yeah, I, I do think I'm going to add another part to this documentary series where, uh, where I try and talk about solutions, but that, no, the government doesn't need to back off. We need them in this situation. The companies have gotten out of control. Uh, I did not know that Gmail blocks the verification emails for websites like Vanilla. 
Uh, I'm pretty sure it probably goes to your spam folder, maybe? You should, you, you should always have more than one email address anyway. I have more than one. Thoughts on Bing compared to Google? I, I might have to try using that more, but if I'm going to probably use an alternate uh, search engine, uh, I'm probably going to use DuckDuckGo. Uh, thank you, little loony, and I'm going to try and see if I can find any more. Machinima Purge, spoiler. Can you do a video on Chinese other countries' internet censorship and its potential impact globally? Yes. The final episode is going to be on Sesame Credit, and when I do the Google episode, we are going to be talking about uh, Operation Dragonfly. Do you think YouTube will do something about Patreon? I think Patreon is doing something about Patreon. Because uh, in the Twitter episode and in the Patreon episode, I get to talk about controversial people, which is so much fun. So much fun. Bitchute, I, I am not familiar with. What episode are you wanting to tackle most? Uh, all of them? Like, how about a technocracy episode on 4chan forums or Reddit? Reddit was tempting, uh, but the issue there, I think, is that I cover pretty much all the points in previous episodes. Like, Reddit is similar on the censorship with, uh, with Twitter. Uh, it takes more likes on some uh, subreddits for it to get to the main page. Uh, oh yeah, like, when all of these episodes are done, what I'm going to do is update them with new information and then put it all together in one big documentary. Yeah, the Reddit mods are, are, are crazy. Let's see. Would you ever consider doing a video essay on, a video on reboots, remakes? Uh, maybe. I don't know. Like, I, I've done plenty of individual reviews. Oh, yeah, there are, there are free speech social media apps, and they get smeared in the media as alt-right platforms, and platforms that promote hate. Uh, YouTube will try and shut down Patreon. YouTube, I don't think they're going to shut down Patreon. It, it wouldn't be worth it to them. If you're interested in my Era of Animation series, uh, the continuation, I guess, is the Windsor McKay episode. Any thoughts on the breakup with Activision and Bungie? I, I heard that Activision laid off a bunch of employees after, like, they got their best year ever, or a bunch of, uh, a, a bunch of, uh, income. Which, which is really, really sad, because Activision was founded uh, because the employees were being mistreated at Atari and they weren't accredited for their games. Credited for their games. Oh uh, yeah, Defy Media. I, I probably should have put the multi-channel networks thing into the YouTube episode. I think that's the one thing I regret that I didn't cover. Uh, can I, uh, I am, I'm looking for it. I'm going back as I get to it. Uh, let's see. Uh, uh what's your thoughts on stream.me? And I, I had never heard of that website before, sorry. Like, most of my experience is with the, the big websites. Do you think it's possible for Cartoon Network to create its own streaming service, uh, considering their current web infrastructure? I don't think so. Do you have a top five worst decisions taken by YouTube? I, I don't have enough numbers in the world to make a list of the, the, the uh, worst decisions by YouTube. What do you think of porn sites? They're, they're fine. I mean, they're, they're there for a reason. If people go there, they go there.
Given how many YouTubers currently rely on Patreon, it surprises me that Google hasn't bought it and revised the site so people can't make money. Uh, yeah. Wait, wait till you guys get to the payment processors episode. The episode where I talk about Patreon. Like, it's, it's not sunshine and rainbows. It really, really isn't. It's, it's got so many problems and... They've gotten themselves into hot water recently because they decided to censor people. Of course I have friends who are bronies. Uh, thank you, Dark Fire Ice. Do you watch Knickknacks? No, I do not watch Knickknacks. Is government censorship worse than corporate censorship? At this point, corporate censorship is far worse. Like, at least when it comes to government censorship, at least in the states, uh, we can have legal recourse. Will there be a technocracy about cryptocurrency? Uh, it's probably gonna come up in the payment processors episode, probably. I mean, it's not really a social media website. All censorship is bad, yeah, I'm, I'm, up, you, I'm up there with you. Do you think Culture War on YouTube would have lessened, uh... Susan Wojcicki is a very bad CEO. I have no idea why she was put as CEO, unless she was specifically put there so people have a hate sink. So people target her and not the corporate actions that she probably has nothing to do with. Will you ever review Norman the North 2? Yes, it's currently in editing. It's probably going to be the next video up. Article 13? I think that's been talked to to death. Uh, what do you think of... I have never seen that episode, sorry. Like... It, with Susan Wojcicki, go to her Brain Equals site. Every single thing she's ever said is either about representation on the internet or advertising. Everything. Everything. Article 13 is the EU's attempt to censor the internet. It, it's basically SOPA and PIPA, but on crack and having, uh, having a very, uh, larger chance of succeeding. How do you feel about microtransactions? They're stupid. Oh yeah, Norm of the North 2 is, uh, is an asset, asset flip. No, I am not sub to T-Series. Why would I be sub to a music channel that doesn't even speak English? Can YouTube be sued as a monopoly? I, I don't know. Like, with a lot of these... A lot of these websites, a lot of the reason why they're doing what they have is because there's no precedent set. Like, somebody has to get up and sue them. I have not seen Pantene Stalking or Mr. Robot. I'm, I'm not up and up on anime. Will you ever review Food Fight? No, I said I wouldn't. Will this stream be archived? Yeah, I will. At this point, YouTube is a monopoly. Yeah, they need to be broken up like standard oil. Like, there's a reason why uh, weird advertising is happening on weird content. And that's because the website is just too big for its own good, even. Are you subscribed to Angry Joe? I don't think I am. I used to be. I have not seen the Lego Movie 2. No. Is it possible to sue YouTube considering they're owned by Google? Yeah, I think it is possible to sue them. I'm not entirely sure, though. What's your opinion on 4chan? I, I don't go on there. I don't have a reason to. YouTube is the Disney of the internet. No, Google is the Disney of the internet. Uh, will there be a family film failure on Christmas Story? I don't think so. I, I don't dislike it enough to give it a negative review. Let's see. Given the chance, we'd... Ah, so many super chats. Let's see. Uh, let me try and get them one at a time. If given the chance, would you jump ship to a video sharing platform that can, can contend with YouTube? 
I, I would take the chance in a heartbeat. I, I want to get off this site as soon as possible, but doing so is just risky enough to lose everything. And Shady Shy, thank you very much. Like, this vanilla, like, I think so many people do want to go to something like that, but nobody wants to make the first move. That is why so many of these things fail. I don't know why, but on the internet, audiences do not follow you. If, if they got to know you on YouTube, they very rarely will go to Dailymotion or Vimeo. I mean, unless you get slapped off the site completely. But I don't think anybody would be willing to do that themselves. Uh, thank you for making great... Uh, thank you, Shadow Fang. Uh, what do you think about Disney owning most of Fox? I think I brought that up in my uh, Miracle on Evergreen Terrace video. I, I, I think Disney owns too much. I really do. Any anime that should get an animated atrocity? I, I don't... I, I'm not uh, up and up on many anime series, unfortunately. Let's see. Yeah, Daily Motion and Vimeo are are annoying to use as hell. The only reason that people use Daily Motion is to get stuff that would get copyright restricted on YouTube. Uh, do I think Gumball is ending? I, I hope it does. It's it's gone on long enough. How do you feel about MLP ending at season nine? And I think I think it had a good run. What's your thoughts about the Channel Oz and controversy? That feels like ancient history at this point. It was like what a year ago now. <sighs> Why do you mind no such luck from from the Loud House? Because. Uh, Lincoln took uh, over advantage of his situation. Thoughts on Young Justice Season 3? It's been a long time since I've seen Young Justice. And I haven't seen Unikitty. <sighs> Is Butch Hartman still hated? I think he's forgotten about now. Do you think of enough people promoted a site like Vanilla, YouTube competitor as a YouTuber? Probably. What absolutely needs to happen is that this website needs to be able to pay people who go on their website. Vidme was not able to do that, and that is the primary reason why it failed. How do you feel about YouTube letting children watch gore fan films and Elsa gave videos? They should... Like, those people have hacked the algorithms. The algorithms have always been hacked and exploited. Like, when it was just views, people would post risque thumbnails. Uh, like, there are days worth of videos uploaded every single hour. YouTube is just too big to reasonably police so yes any all any website like the wall street journal needs to do is just look hard enough and they'll they'll find something let's see if you're doing psx quest again i can help translate the japanese only games that would be really helpful although i i don't want to double my my load Of the two main parties, which is most likely to have a trust-busting spree? Uh, the, the Republicans are much more likely to have a trust-busting spree because 
they are the ones who are going to they are the ones who have been censored more often by sites like Reddit and Twitter. Like it's it's not really in dispute. The right wing right, conservative opinions are far more censored online. Did you hear about the videos that can be demonetized just by the video's comment section using vulgar language? Yeah, I, I've heard about the news. Do you think that YouTube will actually get rid of the dislike bu button? If the answer is, if, if the question is, will YouTube make the site worse, the answer is probably yes at this point. Yeah, Daily Motion will not become a viable alternative because it's based in Europe. And the EU... Uh, What are your thoughts on the Teen Titans Go movie? There's going to be a review on that too. That That's with Crimson Mayhem, my first editor. What's the scariest thing you've experienced while being on the internet? Uh, I, I think I talked about that in my internet harassment video where somebody spoofed my email to send terroristic threats to foreign governments. I'm still going to make YouTube videos as a hobby, but anything about having a full-time job feels like a fantasy now. Yeah, I know what you mean. Like, as, as somebody who has a job online, I feel kind of the same way. How this just feels like the fantasy. Like, it might sound like I've lost passion, but I, I'm just... I, I, I can only fight for so long. Uh, thank you, C.R. Martin. Like, I don't know how much fight I have in me. Like, how much I can keep going. Just, like, it's not entirely about money. I have some saved up it won't last forever but like it, it's just force of will that's being depleted at this rate it really is have you heard about the netflix series the dragon prince uh no i i might i might check it out at some point though what's your total take on the wake up youtube movement i believe another apocalypse should be in place i don't like like these awful like the pedophiles that are exploiting the system like they're not in it for the money. Like, if there was no ads or whatever, they, they'd still be doing what they're doing. Targeting the ads is just basically a scorched earth policy. It's like... Ugh, Tumblr's stupid now. It, it's been stupid for a while. Also, like, if you're doing a hardcore swear, uh, YouTube is auto-censoring the chat, so I'm trying to... If Daily Motion relocated to the U.S., could they survive? No, they get sued by Viacom. Flat out. If you want to have a site like that, you got to move to a place like Russia. That's true, but I don't consider YouTube a job. It is. It is. This this isn't in dispute. If you get paid for doing work, like right now, it's tax season and. And if, if you don't believe this is a job, let me tell you what I go through with taxes. I need to print out pretty much every receipt of everything I bought that has to do with anything on the uh, what I do. Like, for instance, I buy one episode of Futurama, I have to print out the receipt of that. Uh, thank you, Laura Harbeth. Animation Club is, is interesting. Ah, yes, the Madoka review. It, it's going to be a little bit as I get to the other Patreon reviews. Being a content creator on YouTube is literally being self-employed. And the area I'm in is, is probably leaves me very vulnerable to being very hard to, to get funding for myself and other methods besides advertising or patreon donations I mean, streaming isn't something i can do often because i don't have any visuals to show i'm i am a gamer but i'm not a, a youtube gamer at least i haven't made a career off of that i i merchandising like i have my own unique characters, but they're not what my primary audience wants. Uh, Akio01, I, I have made a novel. You can buy it on Amazon. It, it's a children's novel, though, so... 
Do you back up your Steam games on discs? Uh, no I don't. What would you do instead of YouTube? Like, that... That's one of the few things that keeps me going. There's not much else I can do. Branching out on YouTube is... 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 is it's a risk. Not everyone can be a Jello Apocalypse. Uh, yes, uh, thank you, C.R. Martin. It really does ease a lot of the worries. I only use my Facebook account to comment and reply to comments. Should I... Everybody should delete their Facebook account, unless it is the only way to talk to a friend. That is the only reason I think that anybody should have a Facebook account. It, I would I would say try and speak through emails, but Facebook is a lot quicker. But like people, somebody said that the government shouldn't be involved or should back off. No, like one thing that like it should be illegal for companies to be able to read your emails and your instant messages. It should have the same protections as physical mail, but it doesn't. There are a lot of old reviews I regret. One of the Patreon requested reviews coming. Uh, as soon as possible, like I said. The Teen Titans Go to the Movies review is currently... Currently in editing. And, uh... I only have so many editors to do so many things. That That's why I... Uh, why I... Uh, I lost my train of thought. Yeah, Facebook records everything about you, even if you don't have an account. Uh, what is your opinion on gaming on YouTube in general? It, it's a platform for it. The YouTube gaming thing where they just, they try to figure out which video or which video game that's in the video is really, really weird. Like, there was one, like, I watched a video that was, like, talking about an RPG Maker game, and it, YouTube gaming thought that the game was a... Uh, the Rango video game. Do you miss the old days of YouTube? Uh, it depends what you mean by old days. Do you ever think? Do you think a decentralized video service could work? Post videos on an own server, but publish to an indexing server for discovery. Uh, I don't know. Like, uh, one thing that YouTube still does provide is a, a place to put your videos that don't have to be on your hard drive. Like, think of people who make long plays, for instance. A long play of a 10-hour game can be 25 gigabytes or more. You can't just keep that on your own thing. YouTube gamers get special treatment when it comes to monetization in relation to copyright. Maybe. I mean, they used to get special... special, uh... special treatment for copyright, but then that hit the fan. Will YouTube teeter closer to Mad Max or 1984? I, I, I'm just wondering when this site is gonna die. Like, the only reason why it's still around is because it doesn't make money. It's not meant to make money. Hi, Enter. What are your thoughts on Discord? I like it. I, I just wish that when you got a Discord message, it didn't stop the whole left side of, or the whole right side of your screen from letting you click on anything. How do you file your taxes with YouTube AdSense monetization? I, uh, YouTube, uh, you basically have to keep track of everything yourself. Uh, considering you're self-employed, you have to pay both your thing and the employers. YouTube messed up YouTube by selling it to Google. Maybe if if. YouTube didn't sell to Google, they might have gotten just sued out of existing, like... Napster. Disney should stop making live-action films in general. Uh. Oh, the, the Invader Zim... Uh, uh, movie's coming out? When is that? Favorite and least favorite Teen Titans episodes? Not entirely sure. I, I do have to go through the entire series again uh, to really go through it. It's been a long time since I've uh, seen every single episode. Uh, How Long is Forever still really holds up to me, though.
yes, Viacom was uploading their own episodes onto the site. Specifically cited as evidence. Would you do a technocracy episode on DeviantArt? Uh, not really. Like, most of their problems is just general incompetence. They have some weird shit, but nothing that's blockbusting. At what time did Viacom start to be evil? Did it ever not be evil? I, I, if there was a time I wasn't around? What do you do when you feel like the media is against you? I'm feeling that with... What do you do? What do you do? What do you do? Good question! I guess you... Do, you pull a PewDiePie. What about the Tumblr porn? What about it? What was my favorite, least favorite cartoons or movies of the year? This year? I, I didn't really watch much new stuff. For Patreon views, is it possible to commission a review of an Emerald Atrocity where you focus on one episode and talk about... Uh, right now, the Patreon reward where I look into specific things is not available because, uh, my queue is full. Uh, yeah. Why haven't I gotten the Alex Jones treatment? Because what I talk about is provable. It's not conspiracy, it's le like, I use legitimate sources and I'm not making shit up. Uh, Josh and Nolan, uh, you're welcome. It's always nice to experience, uh, new things. Uh, I'll have to think about what, uh, uh, rewards I add. 2019 is gonna be the best year in cinema in the 2010s. I hope so. It's looking pretty good for animation. What are your thoughts on Friendship is Magic ending? Like, it, it had a good run, you know? Nine seasons is impressive. Especially for a reboot of a, a franchise that was going downhill. Thoughts on the Spongebob 3 deleted scenes? I, I don't know. Alex Jones deserved to be banned. Hmm. I, the, the reason why so many people were against Alex Jones being banned is because it sets a precedent. Like, where does it end? Like, when you start banning people like him who technically haven't broken the rules of a site, you keep narrowing it down and narrowing it down until more and more crazies or more and more rational things are seen as crazy. Uh, Akimo Riji. And... Mortal K. The Shaggy memes are weird to me. Who's Alex Jones? Alex Jones is a conspiracy theorist. And that's all that he is. Is there a way you see YouTube redeeming itself? Uh, that depends. Do you, do you think that Google has the technology to build a time machine? Do you ever have nightmares? Uh, a lot. Thoughts on them not playing Sweet Victory at the Super Bowl? I, I honestly didn't expect them to. Right. I hate everything that the, these... Like, when the twi Twitter episode and in the Payment Processors episode... Like, a, a lot of it, a lot of it is going to be, I, I hate what these people are saying, but I have to defend their right to say these things. Like, if Alex Jones was throwing around threats, then he should be prosecuted. Like, and, like I said, like, Facebook bannings or whatever, that, that's irrelevant. He's being sued. Are you planning on making Growing Around a television cartoon? No, an internet cartoon. Who's the thing? Let's see. Will there be videos on the How to Train Your Dragon franchise? I don't know what I could say to it. Or say about it that hasn't been said. 
Uh, yes, I will do the top... Like, I've already gotten half the script for the top 10 worst cartoons of the 2010s done. It's it's probably going to be out before the end of the year. Uh, yes, I have heard that you can get demonetized for YouTube comments now. Thoughts about reviewing online animation. I've done that a couple of times already. I do not do well around crowds, no. Like, the people who are arguing over freedom of speech with, like, Alex Jones, like... I, 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 re I legitimately do hate that these are the people that the arguments are over. It, it's much, much easier when the arguments are over, like, say, artists or something. Any good advice for someone who may go into you go into a YouTube switch Twitch streamer? I, I don't know if there is any advice I can give at this point. Like, every every passing update does make me more fatalistic. It really, really does. <sighs> Any games that you want to play right now? Oh, there are plenty of games I want to play right now. Freedom of speech is there to protect offensive speech. Inoffensive speech doesn't need to protect... Yeah, pretty much. Like, there are plenty of uh, misconceptions about freedom of speech that are going around. Like, you probably heard this before, that hate speech is not protected by free speech. Uh, but it is. Hate speech is protected under the First Amendment. Any laws that prohibit hate speech are unconstitutional in the United States. I have not seen the, uh, Crudes show, no. What's the deal with PayPal? Uh... PayPal also has the ability to censor you and ban you at their own discretion, which is terrifying as hell. Would you review video games? They are animated. Uh, to the, would you review video games? I want to. I, I really do. Like, maybe I'll, I'll do a series on, uh, Vanilla. Should children be allowed on YouTube? Uh, well, I, I, m much of my audience is very young, let's say. Like, I, I think the problem is that YouTube decided to start marketing towards kids, like, very late into its lifespan. Like, if you want to make a kid's website, you have to do it from the ground up. You can't just take Tumblr and make it child-friendly. You, you can't do that. Patreon's worse than PayPal. I'm going to tell you that right now. I, I don't I don't read many books, unfortunately. I, I don't have the time. Will the cartoon community be affected by the second uh every every community is going to be affected by these things. What's your favorite social media site? The one that I get along with the most is DeviantArt. It has its problems, but it, 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 it's probably the one I'm most comfortable on. Like, it's the only one that I feel like it's not going to stab me in the back. They have issues, but what place doesn't? How oversaturated is the animation industry with CGI? Too much. Yeah, don't like it, make your own payment processor. Like, people are making their own internet, uh, basically. Which which is going to lead to more problems. Uh, I'm really interested to see how well the Twitter episode is received. Thoughts on Twitch compared to YouTube? I, I've heard that they're more censorious than YouTube. That's just what I've heard. Uh, new Super Chat. Oh, it's all Super Chat. Uh, thank you, the king. Uh, like, I'm, I'm really proud of this technocracy series. 
I I'm really, really hope that it gets the attention that it needs. Thoughts on the deep web? Um, I, I don't know. Like, I mean, I could go over some of the points that are going to be in the Twitter episode. Like, say Twitter doesn't like a politician. All they have to do is bump them off. And goodbye, politician. Nobody can follow them anymore. They're gone. They can't get their word out except through the media. That that will do take every chance they can to edit up their words. Any plans to start doing Let's Plays? I, I do pseudo Let's Plays on Challenge Accepted. I have not seen Ralph Breaks the Internet or Game of Thrones. <laughs> yeah, Twitch is obviously the most likely competitor to YouTube, but right now they have... They have different sides. Enter, is this technocracy series a long-term change in direction? I'm going to be reviewing cartoons along the side. Like, uh, much of me does want to, uh, I don't know, spread my wings and try other things. Like, for years now, I have been trying other things. Not really much has taken off. Like, uh, when it comes to internet fame and internet careers, very off, very rarely do you actually, you know, pick what you do. I like Duck Duck Doe in Duck Duck Go in concept. The issue though is that uh, Google still is a better search engine. It's it's better at finding what you want. Wait, Moana is in Moana is rated. PG-13 in your country? That, that's weird. I don't remember anything like that in Moana. Zootopia, I, I kind of understand if, if the material is a bit sensitive to you. Will you ever restart your Indiegogo projects? Maybe. I got I got plans. What do you do when you're bored? I'm, I'm never bored. Ever. What is the next episode of Technocracy, and what is it about? Uh, the next episode of Technocracy is Twitter, and it's going to be an editing once once the Teen Titans Go review is out. I have not seen Craig of the Creek. Uh, what? No, the uh, second to last episode of Technocracy is on Google. Animal animations in the line? Yes, yes I do. Yeah, I guess it depends what you're looking for. Have you ever watched Destiny? Uh, no, I haven't watched him. I've heard a lot about him, but uh, considering I know that he's controversial, I, I can't assume that much of it is entirely accurate. Which social media site do you dislike the most? I'm really starting to hate YouTube. <laughs> or starting. Starting is the wrong word. What's worse, The Last Airbender or Dragon Ball? I haven't watched Dragon Ball Evolution. What are your thoughts on the Godzilla King of the Monsters trailer? Not much into Godzilla either. You're never bored, that's an achievement. How can I be bored when there's just so much to do? I have access to the entirety of human knowledge right now. There's so many projects I want to do. I could play pretty much any video game imaginable. Did you hear YouTube will demonetize you for comments? Yeah, uh, no, not on 4chan or Reddit. Like, there's not much I can say about Reddit that I wouldn't say in the Twitter episode. Uh, technology isn't just internet, but also hardware. Uh, this documentary is not about the hardware. Vanilla? I'm not on Vanilla yet. Uh, it, it does appear to be more promising than, say, Vidme. Apparently, they've got... Uh, 
permission from like Microsoft to to be on their platforms, which is a is a huge step. And they're being fairly active on Twitter, which is very good. Do I like Reddit? Reddit's a good time waster. It really, really is. Thoughts on Minecraft? Minecraft's fun. It's it's really overhated. Like, like it's it's very very popular because it's very good. Uh, do an April Fool's video. Maybe I will. Considering advent of remasterings of video games like Crash Bandicoot Inspire, how would you feel about remastering of older CG animated films like Toy Story or Shrek? I'm getting tired of the remakes and the remasters. Like, with with the Spyro remakes and the Spyro... Well, the Spyro remakes and, and the Crash Bandicoot remakes, the first thing that comes to my mind when I play these, or look at them, is I want to see these companies make a new game in the vein of the originals. The remakes are nice to have, but I would like something new. Yeah, I, I don't sound angry anymore. I, I sound depressed. That That's 2019 me. How big is your backlog for video games? Uh, let's see. Every, uh, there's hundreds of Steam games. There's every SNES game, every PlayStation game, every NES game. A lot. Besides Hunchback, favorite Disney Renaissance movie? Aladdin! So I'm particularly excited about the remake. I have not caught up with Steven Universe. Ugh. So what do you think about Defy Media? Shut down for... St Defy is a bunch of... Uh, Scammers, apparently. Have you seen Into the Spider-Verse? No, I have not. Will that parody of Zeus' service ever appear again? No. Friend like me. Oh, I, I don't think it's gonna have a musical number because China is a major, major market for uh, movies and apparently don't like musicals, which is why Milan is not going to be a musical. Are you familiar with Subscribestar situation? Yes. I am actively familiar with it and it's going to be a centerpiece in the, the PayPal the payment processors technocracy episode. Thoughts about cartoons of the future? I'll just I'll just have to wait for them. Will you ever look to anime for 2D movies? I don't have much of a choice. Yes, China hates Winnie the Pooh. Uh, I believe that uh, back then the Chinese market wasn't as uh, big as it is now. Like, a lot of Hollywood pictures really, really depend on China's movie-going revenue. Like, the absolute death knell for... Ghostbusters 2016 was that it was banned in China because of its thoughts on the undead. How many sets of Lego do you own? None anymore. Who drew the thumbnail? Uh, that would be Sleepy Corvid. I believe I've, I linked to her in the, uh, the videos. Although, it's going to be harder because... YouTube got rid of credits! I, I don't know why they got rid of credits. Why did they do that? Do you watch any Let's Players? I, I watch lots of Let's Players. I think my subscriptions on this channel are public. No, I don't own a trench coat and fe fedora. Am I doing okay in general? I, I don't know. I really don't know. Uh... Review of Thief and the Cobbler. I, I don't know if I can do it a, a good job. Uh, Sleepy Corvette, not Corvett. I'm, I'm probably going to ask her for um, an interview for the Tumblr episode because uh, that was her primary place of, of getting revenue. 
You should go to a con in the big trench coat and fedora. If you, if you go to places like that, wearing a tr dress like that, you're probably going to get arrested. Uh, no, I do not watch folding ideas. Uh, if you delete your Facebook account, they, they basically just don't get more information out of you. They just keep all the information they have. Will you ever review Futurama? Well, I'm, I'm watching it a lot. Uh... Uh, that's the series I'm currently marathoning. Uh, thank you, uh, uh, Radria. I think you'll be heading up to VidCon. I, I, I don't do cons. I'm, I'm not a, uh, crowd person. Any progress on growing around? Yes. We make progress all the time. It's one of the few things that is actually very much moving. Uh, thank you, Maria Mariana. I, I hope, like, at the very least, like, uh, if it's not getting on to trending or whatever, I hope that it's at the very least opening a lot of eyes to the stuff that's going on and making people think. Where are you subscribed to? Uh, you'll have to check my list. I'm subscribed to over 100 people. I think even over 200 people. Uh, Psychonauts is a wonderful game. If I deleted, uh, yeah, they probably would be able to get information from your friends and family. Hmm. What's a social media site you think treats their users the best, or least worst? I don't know if that would be DeviantArt. Ugh. I don't want to, like, I don't want to give it the highest praise imaginable because it has a, a lot of, uh, a lot of issues, but it does seem to be the best by default so far. Thoughts on Digibro? I haven't, I haven't paid attention to him since, uh, since he stopped reviewing MLP, so I have no idea what he's been up to. What do you think uh, the state of YouTube will be after the internet goes 3D? 3D? What? Uh, have you ever thought about making a movie? Well, technically, uh, this uh, technocracy thing is a movie. It's, it's, it's a documentary, which is a movie. What is the most jarring ass... Uh, thank you... Lorenzo Rubio. Uh, what is the most jarring aspect of these sites uh, when researching? It's usually just how callous they are. Like, how much, like, no matter what happens, like, how much they do not care. In every situation, it's just how much they do not care. Like, I've looked a lot about, uh, a lot of interviews with each of these, uh, with each of the hosts. I forget if Jack Conti or Jack Dorsey is the Twitter guy, the Twitter CEO. One of them is the CEO of Patreon, the other is the CEO of Twitter. Uh, but one of the Jacks, the, the Twitter Jack, uh, I watched an interview with him and he, like, never blinks. Ever. He just never blinks. He, he keeps on staring. Do you think TV and gaming will die eventually because of streaming services? I don't know. Gaming's pretty strong right now. Yeah. Okay. Dorsey. Okay. Dorsey is Twitter. Okay. Yeah. Jack Dorsey is the Twitter guy. Jack Conti is the Patreon guy. I have no idea why they both have to be named Jack. Uh, what music have you been listening to lately? Uh, I don't know. Everything. A hey, quick question: What do you, th what do you think of Twitter? Uh, the Twitter episode is going to be the longest so far. The only episode that might be longer is Google. But uh, Twitter is going to be the longest episode because Twitter has got problems. 
like every single company and whatever they, they generally go down at some point thoughts on the second spongebob movie it's it's better than the first never trust a ceo named jack apparently i'm sure there's a good jack out there what do you think of quora uh it, it's another good time waster What comes after social media? Uh, I don't know. Ultimately, like, I gave you all of the information about what Facebook is doing. All the information that I know. New controversies can come up at any point, and I may not have uncovered everything. Now that you have the information, you have to make the choice for yourself. Could you rank the show as movies requested from you on Patreon? Uh, no, because I haven't seen everything. Like, I'm focusing on them one at a time. Uh, have you heard they're making a Sly Cooper television series? Uh, apparently I have now. I, I still need to play those games. Do you have information on YouTube's structure as a company that explains their constant poor decisions? Uh, the structure is this. This is a company that doesn't need to rely on money. Like, I'm, if, if everybody left, if there was no advertisements on YouTube at all, and there was no money whatsoever, it would still exist just fine. Is there any internet in the Technocracy series that concerns video game companies like Nintendo? Uh, Steam might come up in the Apple episode because it's got the same problem as Apple, where everything you buy on Steam, you do not own. Like, I, I, like if there's one thing of this entire thing that baffles me the most, it's how we've gone on so long with just uh, buying things as a service. Like, how digital property isn't a thing. What got you down this social media rabbit hole to begin with? Uh, the fact that my livelihood and my future prospects are in grave jeopardy because of the arrogance of the Silicon Valley tycoons. How do you own something that you bought from Steam or Apple? You don't. You, you don't. Yeah, I've heard what happens uh, to Reggie. Ah, uh, yes. With good old games, what you buy there, you actually do own, from what I heard. Yeah. If you can, I would highly recommend buying the good old games version. I probably should have done that more often myself. I mean, if you're just looking to save money, like... I don't think that Steam is gonna, uh, or I don't think Valve is gonna turn evil or whatever, but you, you gotta understand that if Valve at any point goes bankrupt, everything you've bought from Steam, it's not yours. It, it probably doesn't exist anymore. So, like, people say that a second video game crash is impossible. No, like, if Valve goes bankrupt, there will be a second video game crash. Uh, yes, I have seen Adam Ruins Everything. What's your opinion on honor? Like, what, the, the concept? I'm not eating anything. Oh, what's my thought, my opinion on horror? Uh, it's good in Halloween. Ah, uh, yes, this live stream is going to be archived. All of them are. How do you think the 2010s will be compared to the, tw the 2020s? Uh, I, I hope things are less divided. Like, uh, what, what are you rustling around? Napkins. My thoughts on the good Judas contract comic. I haven't uh, read that. Why do you think Apple is so popular when they're overpriced, underspecked? 
they basically live on brand recognition. That That is Apple's business model. Uh, most overrated Disney movie? I'm gonna say Moana. I, I really don't understand why people like Moana. I can understand why people like Frozen, even though I've, I've soured on that movie, but I have no idea why people like Moana. No, I, I actually don't like jazz. It's one of my least favorite, uh, least favorite music genres. My favorite video game of all time is Stardew Valley. You, you probably shouldn't take advice from Lily Orchard. You really shouldn't. Yeah, Valve hasn't made a game in a long, long time. The closest thing you got to a Valve game is Hunt Down the Freeman. Because YouTube is beyond fixing. They're, they're, they're suffering from Ivory Tower Syndrome. They really, really are. Ah, uh, I haven't seen Disenchantment. Uh, I'm going to see it after I, I watch through Futurama. <sighs> Random channel determinations? They're bad. I, I don't want to talk about Lily Orchard. Uh, what's Ivory Tower Syndrome? When someone is in an Ivory Tower, they basically think that the rest of the world doesn't exist. They're so high up in their own ass. Yeah, all of Silicon Valley suffers from Ivory Tower Syndrome. How out of touch is Susan Wojcicki? Let me, let me... Susan Wojcicki Rainey quote. This, this is my favorite type of humor, by the way. Well, I, let's see what she has to say. <laughs> no face cam, I don't, I don't have a, I don't have a webcam. Susan Wojcicki, I love taking an idea to a prototype and then to a product that millions of people use. Work smart, get things done. Not all jazz is bad, but uh, uh, it's my least favorite genre. Uh, could you make vlogs on the things that you watch? That would that would take too much time and YouTube doesn't like that it doesn't like video spam I have a lot of setbacks that I have learned from New videos coming soon? Of course. Of course they're coming soon. Something's always in the works. Uh, that never-ending story cartoon. Uh, I hope so. I hope to do it soon. Aren't you playing jazz? No, I, I'm not playing jazz. I, I can't play any music. If you were suddenly the CEO of YouTube, what would be the very first thing you would do to fix the site? Oh, first of all, I, I would have to make sure it's not a ploy to... I don't know. There's just so much. 
What is the music playing? It's video game music. It's video game music, okay. Let me fix it for you. There we go. I have no idea what the Canadian content law is. I would... Uh, no, I'm not a comic book guy, Alyssa. Thoughts on GTA? I'm, I'm, I don't play the GTA series. What's your opinion on the music of the 2010s? Early 2010s, really, uh, pretty, pretty good. Late 2010s, not a fan at all. Dunt, that's an episode I haven't heard of in quite, or haven't watched in quite some time. Alright, I'm thinking that this chat is dying down, so, uh, not gonna be on too much longer. My favorite video game series is Zelda. If you want to delete your sites, like, just, you have to make that decision yourself. It's not something I can make for you. I can only give you the information. What you do is entirely on your, uh, your choice. Worst Disney movie besides Chicken Little is probably Home on the Range. So the, these these questions are starting to get repetitive. So yeah. All right. Uh, good night. I, I had fun. I hope I hope you guys had some fun too as we talked about how the world is ending. Uh, I'll, I'll have to do this uh, some other time. And uh, maybe I'll I'll have some more interesting visuals and actually do something besides just talk. So goodbye to all of you.